for story time. All right, let's go. Three, two, one. This is the first capsule ever to come back from the planet. We have visual confirmation. I see it. This could be a major scientific breakthrough. Come on, 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 come on. Woo! It's like Ren and Stimpy. Jake, what is really? happening? I just, my shirt was apparently <laughs> there's an issue with my shirt. Right? <laughs> I can't. Okay. Jake, I met you at Source Code. <clears throat> Haven't seen you since then. Look at all you've done. Right. Both of you. And Ryan, you're still alive. And Ryan, <laughs> you guys. Which uh, surprises yeah, everyone. You're one of my favorites. So favorite, here we so. go. Continue to use uh, and abuse <laughs> oxygen. Don't you know so. how it works? So they have to give the compliment to the person that they are not as interested in an issue. No, no, that's, that's how it is. Then, yeah. then so Jake, far, so nobody's done really great work. Hey, Ryan. I'm glad Ryan, you're Robbie here, Reynolds. Ryan. Thank you. Very I, you glad know, I'm you're glad here. I'm here too. Thank, thank you very much. Will you guys have a movie that's a comedy? I think it ought to be uh, on the works. Right? Yeah. I know. I don't know. Yeah. We're somebody's... um in discussions um, <laughs> yeah. about a number of projects. We're in early talks about dinner tonight. <laughs> <laughs> the moral of the story: Don't bond with aliens. The, I think the moral of the story could be that humans are garbage. Um, <laughs> or edible. Just, or I'm edible. Sure. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, we invite this you know, organism onto this into our tiny ship, which is always a bit of a Got you know dice future. roll. Yeah, but we'll throw the dice right there, and then and then um, <laughs> and then obviously this thing is is just trying to survive. It's not necessarily you can't characterize it as good or bad or anything really? like that. It just wants to survive. Yeah. I mean, what's more terrifying than human beings? Can you imagine right. if someone took you off, off of the Earth and put you in a little no. plastic box in a no. spaceship? And then, like, you know, you just, how would you respond? Then reanimated you, you I, and I stuff. Yeah. You. Yeah. You you'd go nuts. Yes. So that's Absolutely. sort of what happens here. This thing goes nuts. These creatures wiped out Mars. Millions of years ago. If we let it get to Earth, we'll risk all human life. Let's kill the thing. If Calvin had a voice, what, who would he sound like? Calvin Coolidge, I would guess. <laughs> Honestly, though, like Daniel Espinosa, because our director, because he was always in our ears telling us yeah. where Calvin was, because we had these earpieces. And so whenever we were watching stuff, he was on a microphone watching us in the monitor telling where he was. So to me, Calvin sounds like Daniel Espinosa. Wow. What would he be saying? What would he sound like? He's like, no, it's going to the left. No, it's going to the right. <laughs> really? I love it. I love it. You know, stuff like that. You know? No, he's a European fashion magnate. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, for me, he'd probably sound like a young Christina Aguilera. <laughs> And what would that sound like? So, well, you don't want to hear that. Yeah, It'll sound like a genie in a bottle. Yeah, so yeah, it really? sound like, yeah. Let's yeah. <laughs> be honest. Do you think in our uh, lifetime we're going to see UFOs or aliens or your lifetime maybe, not mine? <laughs> What are you? I'm older. Oh, please. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm in, I work in Hollywood. He's I'm a 79. thousand years old. <laughs> are you kidding me? I mean, he's basically falling apart. Yes, you should have seen him absolutely. walk in here. They glued his I legs onto the chair. When I cough, you see actual dust <laughs> come out. Um, I, uh, well, we see a UFO. I don't know if we'll see a UFO, but I mean, a UFO doesn't def technically count as an alien, alien no. right? It's a, a just, creature. I just can't an identify that creature. thing in the air. I, the other day I saw a turkey vulture flying by, and that technically, <laughs> UFO. That's Whoa. a dinosaur. Yeah. Go. But you saw looking. it fly? Yeah, sort of like a float on yeah. a rock. <laughs> yeah, that's and more like, like uh, it. Yeah. 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 Sort of like, uh, whoa, whoa, yeah. whoa, 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 whoa. Turkey vultures yeah. are technically dinosaurs. Are they really? They're dinosaurs. Oh, wow. They're also technically hilarious. <laughs> They're very scary. But, yeah, they are. They're scarier Big, than crazy Calvin. Things. I knew we'd get into this <laughs> today. At one point. I knew this was going to rear its ugly head again. Um, Where... Where are we? The we're, hell were we're we? Ending. Oh, but yeah, it, really? it was such a this pleasure. Was so I nice. And this too shall pass. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. could keep going with both of you, so hopefully as, we'll get as to As could do we. It again. Thank you. I would love that. Bye. Thank you.